I don't want to fit in. I don't want to be normal. I don't want temporary comfort. I don't want to be somebody else. I don't want to just go with the flow. I create my own reality. For when you step out your own little bubble, that's when your life starts to change. If something is toxic, leave it. If something is taking away from your future, cut it off. You have the power. You have the ability. You must stop living a small life to make others happy. The reality is all of us are surrounded by people that we love, that want good things for us. And yet, when we begin to strive, when we begin to change and transform and become that person we were always meant to be, suddenly, the people in our lives that love us the most are often the ones that come at us accusing us being changed and making us feel guilty for trying to become something new. But at the end of the day, that's about them. That's their insecurity being brought onto you. It has nothing to do with you. The life that you craft for yourself, the life that you want to live is something that should fill you with excitement and shouldn't have anything to do with what other people think. And that's why, even though we're taught to fit in, we're taught to be like our parents, be like everyone else to be accepted, you cannot. You see, life's planted that dream inside of you. It's meant for you to pursue it. That's why when you tell other people your goals, they don't see your vision the way you do. And that's why you cannot conform for the sake of your own happiness. And you cannot allow small-minded people to make you small. You've got to be willing to reach for something. You've got to be willing to strive, to change, to gain mastery, to truly be the best at what you love. And when you do that, if some people get left behind, remember, it's not you letting them go. It's them refusing to keep up. And it's heartbreaking to watch that when someone that you love, when it's someone that you care about, to see them accuse you of something, it doesn't mean they don't love you. That's the weirdest thing about this. It doesn't mean they don't care. It simply means they can't get past the way it makes them feel because they haven't accepted responsibility for their life. The people who say you've changed are the people that really are just saying they don't like how you're acting because it's not how they want you to act. You're not acting in their expectations of what you should be doing. Don't let their vision of the trap that they're in become the prison of your mind. You've got to understand this life is about pushing yourself to see how much you can do because you can really do whatever you set your mind to. But first, you have to set your mind to being free of what others think of you. We have a great life in front of us, but it's in front of us, not behind us. Remember that. Peace and love.